Hello, welcome back to our TCAP commentary. Um, today we're doing Michael Gentile now. Um, I've never done this guy before, right? <laughs> he is one of the predators that I miss from Hansen vs. Predator, right? He isn't popular much, mainly because he doesn't have an actual sit down with Chris Hansen, right? He actually escapes, but he doesn't escape, but he runs from the the house, so he, they, he you know, he doesn't get to sit with Chris Hansen. But anyway, um, yeah, I missed him, and now we're here, you know? I only know a little bit of context, right? Gentile, he likes to be naked, you know? That's, like, his entire identity, right? But, um, anyway, let's get right into this, and, uh, yeah. <laughs> Michael Gentile looks like he could be the grumpy old grandfather next door. Grandpa. But what kind of sick senior citizen would send your kids a perverted picture like this? <laughs> or leave your little girl the most oh. disgusting voicemails imaginable. Please. Hey, my little sex kitten. How are you, sweetheart? Oh, that is Gentile. cringy. That is so cringy, man. See, I thought the hey, baby, from, you know, um... Jo it's not Joshua Cologne. Who is it? Damn, I forgot his name. John Dupay. There he is, right? John Dupay. I forgot. I mean, I thought that his, you know, um, appearance on this show was the creepiest, uh voicemail thing that was left but apparently not you know michael gentile has you know won that him and his you know sleepy eye or whatever his lazy eye he's the latest creep i've caught in our special investigative series hansen versus hansen versus predator no my god <laughs> over the years i've caught more than 300 of them Ooh. why don't you take a seat right over there but let me tell you, Gentile is one of the worst I've ever seen. His aggressive attempts to Ooh, seduce it. Man, I am. Uh, I'm, I, okay, this this is already really bad, and we're not even a minute in, right? But um, Jesus Christ, man, I just can't believe this. You know, I don't have. I like. I like to say that I'm pretty good at talking to women, women, right? But that is, you know, smooth, right? What do you say? It's something about like holding you and kissing you, kidding or whatever. Like, we'll, we'll turn your stomach. I'm kidding, I'm of course. You're so happy. And stop. I love you, baby, so much. Oh, man, stop with the damn voicemails, man. I don't want to hear it. Jesus Christ, that is horrible, man. At least I'm not as bad as that guy, right? Oh, is that Rod Knight? No way. The there he is, man. Rod Knight, man. Oh, Rod Knight. The, the best. The best, you know. I forgot what he, what, he, what his thing is, right? Because he's, he's that good. A security guard, right? The, the head of security. Whatever. Same thing, right? We have, you know, legendary Chris Hansen, you know, fried in this image for some reason. Um, Nervous Nelly, then we have Ron Knight, right? Random guy, the back of this guy's head again, and the back of this guy's head. And I think that's Bulletproof Lori, but I'm not sure, you know. It's just some random person, right? But shout out to the to the contrast of this image, you know, like this very glowy back of the head, you know. All the all the light got, sh got shown, shined, whatever, into the back of this guy's head, right? That's why there's no light in the rest of the room. This guy's head took it all, man. A kitty porn manufacturer. All right, I'm back. My little sister needed something. <laughs> anyway. My little angel. Why'd I go back? Why'd I go back? I want to make you so happy, my little angel. I love you, baby, so much. And you'll be shocked when so you hear what cringy, Pops dude. Gentile was planning. A kitty porn manufacturing site. Ah. Gentile is... Oh, that actually... Whoo! Oh, dude, that actually made me uncomfortable. Like, holy crap! You know, I've had it in these these recordings where it's like, oh, real cringy, right? Oh, I feel it in my spine. This one, it actually like got me, got me. Like, I didn't, you know, it it wasn't a little bit. Like, it actually got me. The, just what the what the, the, the dude? This guy is creepy as hell. He is actually hella creepy. Man, that is that is that is too much you know i just i don't know what to say anymore like you know today my family well some family members of mine are home right so i'm like i'll just record something quick right something not that you know important i guess and i decided to pick this right man gen 2 is such a fucking creep God, man, God. His aggressive attempts to seduce a 13-year-old <sighs> will turn your stomach. Why'd I go back? I you so happy, my little angel. I'm, I'm so sorry. I am actually so and sorry, guys. I'm like... What cops say, it's just out of impulse. It's out of impulse to go back. Gentile is much older than most of the predators I catch. Ah, 64. 64? He says he's a limo driver. 
He likes to play drums and he loves to run around in the nude. He loves to run around he in the nude. Anyway, oh man, I'm, I'm trying to make light of the situation so it's not like so horrible on my psyche, right? But, oh, okay. Let me kind of relax a little bit. It's, it's not going to stop, right? But let me just, you know. Okay, so we have Michael Gentile here. He's 64 years old. Uh, he's a limo driver, and he likes to play drums, right? Uh, he loves to also run around in the nude, right? For some reason. Like, people... Like, I'm sorry if you're one of these people, but I would like to think that my audience isn't a, isn't a bunch of weirdos, right? But running around naked, like, what what's the benefit? Like, I understand it's freeing, and, they, like, it, you know, you don't have to be, con you know, confined by the fabrics uh, or whatever. But it is strange. Like, I mean... Relax, you know. Again, people who make it their identity, identity too, you know. Michael Gentile had nothing else to to add to his personality other than being naked. Okay, let's not go back. Actually, he drums and he loves to run around in the nude. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Video is kind of unpro off. unprofessional. Love to be naked. Oh yeah, and then his his clap man banger man banger username man love to be naked man. Oh banger username man. Forget the the Lee Greer seventy fours. The Thomas Coffins of, 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 you know, usernames for To Catch a Predator, right? Love to be naked is perfect, man. Perfect. Okay. Even the guy down the street, like Charles Lawrence. <laughs> Don't remind me of this fucking old ass decoy, man. I can't believe it, right? I know, like, he's like, he's literally the same age as uh, Nervous Nelly. I believe he's 19 at the time, right? But it, it, it's just, you just can't compare it, right? Like, they, for, for some reason... Um, you know, this decoy looks a lot older, right? I mean, that's just jeans, I guess. I don't know. But anyway, um, Chris Hansen, man. Classic banger, man. No, Chris. Then this, this fucking guy, man. I hate him. I hate this guy more than, than, you know, then I think people hate, you know, like people like, there's not as much hate for him, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't see it often, but I'm also not like in tune with like to catch a predator, right? Like the, the temple teacup or whatever, right? But, like, he smiles while he's being caught. Like, he's just making a whole joke of the entire thing, right? I know, Lauren. I understand the the, the context, right? But still, I hate the it. same commuter train into the city. I was shocked when he showed up shocked. at our sting house to chill with a 13-year-old boy. What are you doing? What are you doing here? Please. Now we have crossovers of Predators, man. Oh, this is a perfect video, man. You know, it gives me a chance to talk about this loser again, right? But I'll, And also talk about the decoy again. But, uh... I'll skip through it. Doesn't matter. You have to explain. You have to explain this to me. This makes no sense, Remember. Lauren. No, Lauren. Today, What's his name? What's his name? I forgot his name. You have to explain this. To me. What's his name again? I know, but you have Rigo. To it doesn't matter. Come here, man. Come here, man. Do not run away. Today it's Gentile who's on the police radar. So with the cooperation of the Fairfield cops, we set up a sting operation. <sighs> You should have that taser out. Oh you man, the taser. Dozen hidden cameras all over in oh, water wow. bottles, in water trash bottles. cans. And on the fence. The police Great. are also They don't showcase the, the microphone underneath the leaf, right, man. Ah. Uh, they know they only had to pull it out for uh, who was it? Was it for Joshua Cologne? Doesn't matter. It's radar. So with the cooperation of the Fairfield <laughs> cops, we set up a sting operation. You should have that a sting operation. Out. Placing more than a dozen hidden cameras all over in water bottles, water in trash bottles. cans, and on the fence. The police are also working with Tetrad Corps. A watchdog Tetra group cool. working to expose online predators. I don't have uh, sex or anything oh, on this. this what? What? I looked down at my phone for one second and what did she say? Okay, but anyway, I searched up Charles Lawrence, okay? I was kind of correct, right? Lauren, Lauren, Lawrence, right? Same thing. I'm um, talking about the, the dude they just showed off with this fucking dude right here, right? But with Tetrad Core. Tetrad Core. A watchdog group working to expose. Bulletproof Lori, man. I don't She's married, though. Oh, damn it, man. They got to her before I did, man. <laughs> a watchdog group working to expose online God, man. I don't have uh, sex or anything oh, on this, totally this okay. local guy. That's Lori what? from Tetrad. She's one of the operatives Lori. who communicates with the predators. I'm just really scared. Can you prove to me right now you don't have a gun? Oh, man. Nervous Nelly, right? Oh, man. What, 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 what a decoy, man. What are the best, man? Again, I understand some people find it weird that I find these girls attractive, but like, yo, leave me the fuck alone. They're, in theory, two years younger than me. A a right now. Like, she is hella old now. What, how old is she? 27? At least? No. I think she's like 25 or 26, right? They're above me anyway. Anyway. <laughs> Nervous Nelly, if you're out there, 
Hit me up. You know where I'm at. <laughs> the predator. I'm just really scared. Can you prove to me right now you don't have a gun? Whatever, the outside man. decoy is a 19 year old theater student who is posing as a also oh man ton of vent you know i i every time you comment something right i know you comment it right it, it, like if i don't like put a little heart on it or like i don't like it i still see it right it's just hard because there's like so many coming in right not to flex or anything but there was this one viewer of mine legit like if you're watching fuck you okay first of all but they were like oh you know it's just very strange that, that you find these decoys attractive right oh they're supposed to look like they're 14 or something, right? And then I pointed out that in this one sting, right? This one segment of the sting, right? This is the only time Nervous Deli wears a dress. And they're like, oh, why do you have to point it out? Bitch, it's part of the thing, dog. It's part of the thing. Anyway, that's my little rant and vent for, for the, the week or whatever. But anyway, <laughs> I don't know, man. Leave me alone, man. Many we Should I read these? On TV. Should I read this? Should, should I read these? Nah, I shouldn't, but I will. <laughs> I'll read some Many of them, right? Can't even put on TV. Okay, okay. Stop. Okay, I'm trying to get a clear view of this, man. There's pictures of himself naked, posing in front of a mirror, in the uh, woods, even sitting on the toilet. On the toilet. His text messages are some of the raunchiest and most... Okay, okay, okay. I think it would be so much better to interact with other... What? I think it would be so much better to interact with other kids if you ever ask about it. I'm getting tired and I feel sick. The... Again? I got to go. One more question. Are you feeling comfortable with me now? Yeah, I guess. First of all, stop misspelling shit. Like, this is just... Okay, whatever. It doesn't matter. Okay, sweet sweetheart. <coughs> I'll get back to you in the morning. I hope you feel better. Please try to keep in touch. Can you sleep naked tonight? I love you. <laughs> okay. As for pictures, I don't get any. I text. I don't get answers. I think I may have to start looking for a new girlfriend. Someone I may have a chance of at least meeting. Sad face. Are you even who and what you say you are? And you still haven't gotten back to me yet. Hi, I'm not grounded anymore. Yay. Ugh. Do you want to go with me? <laughs> LOL. I, wow, I thought people just did that in their yard. I don't know. Do you want me to? I'd be embarrassed. No, you'd be surprised. What t What do you wear to sleep? I would love you to come, s come with me. Uh, first, you have to feel comfortable with your body. With What do you wear to sleep? Yo, stop asking, man. <laughs> I just wear a shirt and, and jammies, pan, jammy pants, right? Oh, my mom retweeted. I don't know. My mom is here. I can't talk right now. Uh, send me a sexy picture, please. I tried calling you. I would love to talk to you for a minute. Let me know when you can, please. I try to send. I try to send me a, and, try, and try to send me a picture. I've lost a little weight since then. How you feeling, sweetheart? But oh, disgusting, imaginable. Fuck, man. Many we can't even put on TV. Okay, I got a good picture, man. Um, I want you to <laughs> to imagine that the banana is me. Um, that's weird. Why'd I suck on your t tonsils? <laughs> on your Let's just say it's penis. I don't know. That's gross. It's just practice for when the real thing ha ever happens. I don't even like bananas. Oh, look, first of all, okay. Now this is our a thing. Okay. Do you like bananas? I'm I'm asking you. Yeah, you. Okay. Me personally, like, it's a I. You know, it's it's not the best. It's not the worst. But like, people that are deadly afraid of bananas, they're, they're strange. Okay, y you're strange. I'm just gonna be honest. But anyway, back to this. Man, I should have not done this. But, you know, I could have maybe slept better uh, tonight, maybe. Uh, I don't even like bananas. LOL. Watch the movie and try it. First of all, he did send, uh, you know, videos, right? Adult videos for her to watch. Uh, what do you think, right? I assume this is the link or whatever. <clears throat> do you have any friends from the neighborhood when you were growing up? We don't live near there anymore. I want you to do something without your parents. Parents, think about it. See if there's anyone that you can call, make me proud of you, sweetheart. I'm sorry, I don't want you to do anything, do anything with your parents. What? Why not? Cause I want you to find someone your age to be a friend of, fr 
to be a friend, a boy or girl, just a friend. Because you're my girlfriend and I am your boyfriend. What do you like about it? Do you like looking at me with no clothes on? It kind of gives me the butterflies in my st- my tummy, man. Butterflies in my stomach, man. Uh, can you send me a picture in your uh, your underwear, please? It, uh, it's like, man, I, I, I was gonna, I'm just gonna skip through those damn parts, man. Oh my god. Uh, can you send pictures? No. You have a a blank. You can send a picture in. Maybe later I'm cold. I don't feel good. I, that's a lot. Oh my god, does it hurt? What? It does hurt the first day, but then I took some aspirin. I feel better. What? When you look up that word, try to find yours. Good. I'm... I'm... What the... Whatever, man. But most involved Gentiles love... Jesus Korean. Christ, that was extremely hard. Oh my God, more, more, uh, more, more text, please. I sent you to a picture on Skype. I'm, I'm naked. naked. I would kiss you all over, LOL. Yesterday, I went to a river upstate and went nude sunbathing. You want to go with me, LOL? Will you try sleeping naked tonight? I sleep naked every night. Want to go with me? Yesterday, Literally no personality outside of being naked. Anyway, um... I sent you a picture on Skype by make it uh I want you to feel better because I don't want to chat with what all over lol yesterday I went to a river I'm not reading these anymore went nude sunbathing <laughs> you want to go with me lol will you try sleeping naked tonight I sleep naked every night Lord he God. sent Brittany links to porn videos asking her to watch and learn remember he thinks he's talking to a 13 year old girl I want you like dude actually like like you know on a serious note i actually feel extremely uncomfortable <laughs> like i'm sweating and it's not even hot i am actually extremely uncomfortable holy shit put that in the books okay though the actual first guy to ever like physically make me uncomfortable was michael gentile <sighs> i'm Remember, sweating i am actually sweating 13 year old girl i want you to feel comfortable looking at <sighs> naked human bodies I also want you to learn what they're doing. Watching those movies is your sex education homework, he oh says. I'm going to give you a test on it tomorrow. Oh Gentile God. asks her to get a banana. I try, I'm trying my best because I realize that it's not just me suffering through this right now. Right? I understand that it's like a me and you thing, right? It's a me and you thing. <laughs> um, you know, I'm going to pause it because I, I'm trying to spare you. Okay, I am suffering. I am actually suffering over here. Holy crap. Oh man, I'm sweating so fucking profusely too. Anna, and do unmentionable things with it. It's just practice for when the real thing ever happens. I want you to imagine her to get a banana. Shouldn't have gone back. Unmentionable things with it. It's just practice for when the real thing ever happens. I want you to imagine that the banana is me. He reveals what could be interpreted as a passion for pedophilia. <sighs> this is a breathing moment for, for me, okay? Um, I'm at the let me commentate a little bit because I need it. Okay, let me tell you what I'm feeling, okay? First of all, you know, the times I've said, right, oh, I wish I could beat up this person. I wish this person was dead, right? Forget all that, homie. This guy is the worst I've ever seen. I wish death upon this man. I'll, I'll come down because YouTube just, uh, for some reason, just likes to back these guys. But anyway, I'll, like, okay, I'll take that back. I, I mean, in the game, okay, in, in a video game, right? I wish to do that in a video game, right? Anyway, um, this guy, he has to go, okay? I, I don't know if he's dead, but he is old. He was 64 when this was, right? It has been, what, almost 10 years? It's been like 7 years or 8 years. You know, uh, he, he's still alive, sadly. I, we I'd went like on think. a tour today of an old castle on the Hudson <sighs> River. There were two girls around your age. I was looking at those girls today, thinking of you and getting so excited. What is even more disturbing? To <laughs> <laughs> I'm just laughing out of nervousness at this point. Okay, let me let me talk. I didn't talk at all, okay? <sighs> so... Um, what can I say? There's really nothing. Nothing's happening. I've just been bombarded by just a bunch of messed up conversations and voice chats. Everything. Like, this is not a good video. This is not. A, this is a horrible video. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Holy shit. <sighs> okay. Okay. So what can I say? What can I say? Help. <laughs> Help. Is, is that what I could say? Anyway. Um, 
Okay, so he just mentioned that whole thing. He went to a river or whatever, and he saw two girls the decoy's age, right, and got excited. That is very bad, right? That That is, you know, I don't believe I've heard of something like that from these predators, right? The whole, like, oh, I saw today, uh, you know, a couple of teens and thought the same thing or thought about you or, like, you know, thought about this and that, right? Like, I don't think anyone had ever said that before, but regardless, like, it's just, man, I'm impressed of how much uh, shit there is in, in this one, right? This is a part of Crime Watch Dailies 2, by the way. You know, the official channel releases. There's no one cut because, of course, he, he didn't get an in, an interview, right? But, man, and it's, we're, oh my god, we're a third in. 